Welcome to Enchanted Tarot. This is for the sign of Sagittarius. It is a general reading. That being said, it may or it may not resonate with you. If it doesn't sound like it's your story, check your other placements. Your messages could be there. This could be your energy or it could be the other person's energy. There's a gate at the heart of this reading and this gate is closed, indicating that there is a barrier that keeps you from the goal. The goal is on the other side of the gate. It is a place that you greatly, you or they greatly desire to to go. Okay, there's something beyond this gate that is greatly desired, that is wished for, that this person uh, wants. Um, they are keeping their feelings hidden with the harlequin here they are they have their shield up they are guarded most likely because they are unsure uh, and or maybe hurting or still hurting this person has a lot of insecurities with the house here um, surrounding this gate and taking this leap of faith that the fool is representing. This card is being clarified by the fool, you see. And there he is. And so the fool is about uh, fresh new starts. And uh, the question is to jump or not to jump, you know. Um, should I follow my heart or not? Um, so one minute, I'll be, I'll be right, right back. Sorry about that. So, um, yeah, so the fool is most likely at a crossroads, doesn't know what lies ahead, uh, may not have a very clear idea of, I feel, what to really expect. They know where they want to go, but they may not have a very clear idea of what to expect when they get there, you know. Um, and so they may be afraid, but they are also very, very curious. Um, they may wonder what might happen if only they were brave enough to take this leap of faith. Um, they could be worried that it's a foolish choice, that others may not agree or support them in this choice. No one is going to force this person to do this. This has to be their choice. But the message here is to follow their heart. Okay? I feel like they're thinking about it. They're looking at it. The barrier that keeps them from their goal, I feel, is their fears. Okay? Um, this guardedness. Uh, this lack of trust, this uh, pain uh, that they are still carrying here with the moon. They look at this opportunity. You see, he's looking at it, but he doesn't hold it. Not yet, anyway, but he wants to. Six of Swords in reverse can indicate... Uh, they may feel there's an unseen danger. Well, that's the danger of uh, them not knowing oh, what to really expect once they get there. Um, they could be uh, wanting to return to this person, this situation, uh, an old situation, but uh, there's a fear of stepping through that gate um, because of the unknown, right? Because of the unknown. They are hoping maybe for a lucky break, um, some new information um, with regards to somebody that they're very attracted to, that they that is greatly desired, they want this cup. You can see it. They want they want this opportunity. On on every level, they want this opportunity. 
this is something that was put up on a shelf you see it was it's kind of tucked up into that branch there and what was put up there was this knight of cups and this is about offering their cup to somebody overcoming the difficulties of the four of the four of wands okay so deepening a relationship um they're hoping they could be hoping that if they wait this out that things will get better by itself that's a possibility um because because of the four of wands actually um it's like the waiting of the three may pay off so this could be what they're hoping that the waiting of the three of swords one minute my dogs are playing I'll be right back sorry sorry about that so um yeah so they're hoping that if they if or they were hoping that if they waited this out that maybe things would get better but it's not Time has passed, especially with this night. Time has passed. The night, the king, time has dragged. That slow-moving energy. So they've been waiting and waiting, hoping for that lucky break. So I kind of feel like there's something this person needs to do or that maybe they don't, really uh want to do or that they're afraid to do but that it would pay off so this risk it's because it feels risky with the fool right so uh this risk uh will pay off but i feel like i feel like they have to take that leap to know they have to take that leap to find out here they're still hurting deep repressed emotions uh, because of a breakup okay and they're looking back at this breakup um, they're looking back at this person and they still feel a connection to this person okay this is also a card that indicates that everything that they're feeling is still going on they're still feeling this connection okay they're still feeling hurt um, they're still uh, hurting over this over this breakup and they are wishing to get this person back or they're wishing for another opportunity but they don't hold it yet in all of the cards we see that although they are wishing for it they do not yet have it they they stand uh, just a short distance from from these opportunities but they do not yet hold it so this person could live around you or close to you especially that the community card is here or, and I mean this could be even like an online community you know this person could be uh, watching you online so there's a certain the reason they now pick the reason they haven't picked it up it's always the same it is there's a certain expectation of what what what's coming you know and um they're very frustrated they're very impatient um because that's all they think about is getting to the other side of that of that fence and, and getting their desire, getting their wish. It's all they think of. But yet, there's a feeling or a certain expectation of, of what that outcome would actually be. This person is hiding their feelings for you. There they are looking at it. Oh, if I only had the courage to reach for it. You know, here they are keeping silent, keeping silent. They may feel like they need more information before they actually take that leap of, of uh, faith, put their heart out on the line, you know. 
a decision they must make. They need a, this is a card of strategy and getting a strategy. There's a lot of books here, so they would definitely be collecting information or seeking it. She says that they could be missing some, so maybe they are missing some information here, and they are waiting on this. Um, definitely this person is avoiding you, oh my God, uh, and they have this decision to make. The decision is to return to you. There you go, you have it right there in the journey card. This is somebody coming to see you. Okay, what worries them is the fact that of, uh, they can't see. It's, it's the unknown. It's what is going to happen. And of course, they imagine what is going to happen, but imagined things are not facts. Okay, so, and the heart, well, the heart has already decided it wants to make this journey. It wants to take this leap of faith. It's just the mind that's holding them back. Here's the pathway. And so the destination can't quite yet be seen on this card. Um, but it is there. It is there. And uh, but I think uh, to get there is going to require a leap of faith. It's going to require a leap of faith because the fool is sitting at the heart of the reading and the fool onto the gate, the fool onto the gate is the issue. So this definitely is going to require a leap of faith. Here, look. <laughs> so we have the emperor over here, and he's all about restoration, restoring the order. It's what he wants. That fish jumped out of the cup, and he wants to get it back. He wants to get back what he's lost, okay? But he's afraid to take this risk. Oh, yeah. See, he doesn't know the outcome. It keeps repeating the same thing over and over. There's the moon again. And so, because they don't know the outcome, they, or they don't know there's no guarantees here, uh, they're afraid if they take that leap of faith, look at this fool, that, that they're going to lose something. If they put their heart out on the line there, that, uh, that they're going to get their heart broken. There's luck in action here, okay? They're, they can have their wish. They can have it. The star is right here. This is wishes coming true. But they are going to be required to take that leap of faith in order to get it or to start the, the process of this wish uh, uh, coming in, you know, to make it happen. It's like that is going to be like the first step, okay? Now, the heart has already decided. The, the mind has to come into alignment with the heart here. That is what I have for you. I thank you for watching, for liking, and for sharing my videos, and for subscribing. Also, thank you to everyone who has sent in a donation. It is greatly appreciated. Many blessings to all of you.